Hey guys, it's Don with American Coach, and today we are going to take a look at this luxurious American Eagle 45K. This thing has 605 horsepower, lots of luxurious amenities inside, so let's go take a look at it. Here we are in front of the 2022 American Eagle 45K. We're going to take a look at this front cap. This front cap was a new design for the 2021 model year and it's really really good looking aggressive front cap you've got nice uh, bright headlights these accent lights are really nice uh, they're functional but they always also look really good at night one thing a lot of people don't know is we like to give you the extra touch in American Coach and this badge will actually be backlit when your uh, running lights are on. So at night, you've got a really nice backlit American Coach badge on the front. Again, really nice aggressive front cap with some nice style upper cap uh, with the marker lights up top. American Coach all has the high mounted bus style chrome mirrors. Those are all, on all American Coach models in 2022. Those are really nice, gives it that high end look. But again, they're functional. They're placed well and there's cameras integrated into the mirrors. So. Uh, those are really nice. Um, American Coach, we continue this stainless, this trim all the way down the side. It gives it a really nice high-end look. Uh, we keep that covered up until it gets to the dealer, um, but that's a really nice high-end look that we continue over the, your step. We are gonna give, we are providing you with uh, a really nice keypad entry handle here. So uh, convenience of you program this with your code and come back to the coach at night or, or from a, a, a walk in the morning and all you have to do is punch in your code and you get back in your coach. It's really nice. Um, all American Coach products have independent front suspension which uh, makes it ride really nice and it gives you tighter turning radius. Um, again, just some of those nice features with American Coach. Um, American Coach is all American Coach products and the Eagle specifically are built on the Liberty Bridge Foundation. So how that Liberty Bridge Foundation works is we get the front and the rear clips from Freightliner Custom Chassis and we pull their, uh, spread those apart to whatever length we need them to be and we drop our exclusive Liberty Bridge and it's fully integrated with those clips from Freightliner um, with huck bolts. Huck bolts are like industrial grade rivets. They just won't come apart. Um, and it makes it makes a, a unified uh, one piece foundation and the backbone of that foundation are two seven and a half inch I-beams running the length of your motorhome. And that just, it gives it, you, you want to start your house with the, a good strong foundation and that's what we're doing at the Liberty Bridge is giving a really nice sturdy foundation. You'll notice one thing on American Coach is we have uh, very little trim around our slide boxes. It gives it a nice clean finish. There's not that big bulky trim that a lot of manufacturers are going to do. We'll get into the luggage base here. Our luggage base, we, we gain uh, storage and room with that Liberty Bridge um, that allows us to open up this luggage space for you. And then another thing we've done on this Eagle is we've given you power slides in your luggage bay so this slide is going to slide out to you with a, a push of a button you do what you need to do put your belongings in there and then it easily goes back in no no need to mess with uh, uh, doing that manually in your eagle that will go both directions um, so this slide will go out to the other side of the coach for convenience this next bay back you've got another power slide tray so again, that will go either direction. Um, and it's nice, you can see how the, these bays are, are essentially one and you can fit all kinds of uh, s uh, equipment in there. All American Coach products come with dual side fuel fills. So you can fill this coach up on either side of the coach. We've kind of placed it in the middle of the coach for your convenience. So it doesn't matter where that pumps at. Uh, you should always have uh, plenty of room to to fill up your uh, fuel tank. This next bay, this is the hydraulic fluid tank for your HWH system. That's HWH is gonna run your jacks and also select slide out uh, rooms in your coach, depending on the floor plan. Right above here, before I forget, 
you got a nice big Samsung LED TV, really, really nice. That is on a an arm that does pop out and pivot for, uh, you can adjust that viewing angle however you need. There is a sound bar back behind there. Moving back down the passenger side, this coach is equipped with eight Dragonfly lithium batteries. This is an option for 2022 that you can opt to have the lithium batteries. It's really, really nice uh, option to have. Okay, the next bay back behind the batteries is gonna be your transfer switch, your, your, your uh, uh, safeguard, battery control center. Uh, you're gonna see your Jaboni solar charger uh, run it up to the top for your solar panel. Now comes some of what I think are some of the best parts about American Coach products and, and us working with Freightliner is you're going to get the Ultra Steer B Series uh, chassis from Freightliner and you're also getting the V Ride from Freightliner. So, first off, V Ride. V Ride is part of the rear end of Freightliner that helps stabilize your coach. So, if you come around a curve or you slowly pull out of a campsite or a campground or a driveway and your coach kind of gets off the side and, and tent, typically what a coach, a big coach of this height and this size will just rock real hard. That V-Ride is going to make that really stable. Another way you're going to feel that is on the highway when a semi blows by you or a wind gust comes, comes across the highway. It's really going to make that nice and stable and there's not going to be much rock. V-Ride is really, really nice. Partner that with the Ultra Steer steerable tag axle. It just makes this coach ride like a Cadillac, that Cadillac ride. So this rear tag axle, and the, the way to tell is if, if you look at each wheel, you see this wheel looks like a front wheel up front. So this one is going to turn at low speeds uh, as you're uh, maneuvering your coach. So it really helps you maneuver out of your driveway or out of your campsite. Uh, in the city, on a city street, you got, got those tight turns. That ultra steer, steerable tag axle is going to be really, really nice. Now, another addition to that, and we can go over this inside, is our Select Drive. So when you partner Select Drive, which is a Select Drive is a, a computer assisted steering column. There's a computer in there that learns. Uh, how much you're fighting that wheel and it's going to kind of take over after time and eventually you're going to be riding down the road and I'll show it to you inside with just a couple fingers holding on to that wheel and it's just V-Ride, the Ultra Steer, the independent front suspension, Select Drive, you start to put all these components together into the American Eagle and it really does have some of the best riding and handling coach on the road today. So if you haven't been able to, to uh, test drive an Eagle, I really encourage you to get out to your local American Coach dealer and test drive one of these things because it rides phenomenal. All right, back to the coach. This last bay is going to be your chassis starting batteries, and you can also see we've got a couple disconnects. One of these is for the body or the, the uh, house belt line up, and another is going to be for the chassis. So these are your main disconnects if you're going to store it for a while or uh, going to be away from your coach for a while. You might want to disconnect those. Um, you're also going to see your uh, deaf fluid container in there. So, all right, coming around to the rear cap, I think the Eagle has a really nice, clean, kind of a sexy rear cap for a motor coach. Um, first thing I want to point out is the big old heavy hitch. That is uh, plenty of power or plenty of uh, capacity to tow whatever you want. Uh, I was at a rally recently and I saw uh, one of our American Eagle owners, he was pulling a trailer, and that trailer had two Jeeps in it, a rock crawling Jeep and a road Jeep and uh, Raggedy Ann and Andy. So uh, those were really, really, really nice to see how our customers use this power that we give them. Again, 605 horsepower Cummins engine here at the back um, with the Freightliner custom chassis. On Eagle, this rear gate we're going to give you inside this door here is a switch. That is on a power switch, so that's a power gate lift. And that's going to allow you to access all of your fluids. Some of you guys like to check your oil, uh, transmission fluid, all that stuff, just for routine maintenance. You can get back here uh, and you don't have to worry about that thing. 
uh, manual and you just come back here and put, and put it down. Again, we're trying to give you those extra features on American Coach. Nice high rear fiberglass cap with there's a camera, the 360 camera, you'll see that inside. You can get a 360 degree view of your coach, bird's eye view. Side mount radiator. All American Coach products have side mount radiator, which is, uh, I know some of you guys are really looking for. One thing I like to make sure everybody notices as I saw you, the, I showed you the def tank on the other side of the coach. Well, some guys like to have that on the on the driver's side. Well, what we do, we've done, we've worked with Freightliner, is you can fill that on the passenger side, but you can also, we've also given you a fill for the def on the driver's side. So either side, you're filling up fuel, you can fill up your def at the same time. So there's your potable water fill right here. This bay is what I kind of refer to as the wet bay. Um, I think we do a really nice job here at American Coach to, to make this look clean. Pull these out of the way, show you some features here. You are gonna have a power, power your uh, 50 amp power cord is on a power reel. So no need to fight that, putting that back in. Also your hose on a power reel. Okay, we're making it convenient for you. There's some, uh, Openings here at the bottom that you can pop these open and run those cords and hoses down through there. Shut this up and lock it and nobody can mess with it. Um, whole house water filtration system. S hook up your city water. You've got your dump, your drains here. Um, flush your tanks with the Santa flush. We've given you a, a little exterior shower or, or whatever you need to do to wash off your equipment or your toys, uh, your, your pet's feet. Um, here, really nice, convenient. One thing, if, if I can get Shauna to show you this, is we've given you a, a Firefly touchscreen monitor out here in the wet bay. So you can monitor your tanks, turn your uh, coach lights on and off. At, you're out here at night trying to uh, hook up your tanks or hook up your water lines. You can, just, you can turn the exterior lights on right here. Um, you can also turn your water pump on and off in case you need the water access back here. It's a really nice high-end feature we've given you on American Eagle. Um, and then again, there is a, a 110 plug there in case you need that. Last thing I want to point out here, and you can't see it because we do a really nice job of, of making this bay look nice and clean and, and buttoned up. Behind this panel, you would see our exclusive wedge tank design. And I think a lot of people might take that for granted, but that is really, really nice. That wedge, that waste tank is, the waste tank, the gray tank, and the fresh water tank are all designed and shaped to fit in between the chassis rails in this compartment here, okay? They won't fit on any other coach. So those wedge tanks, that waste tank is wedged to, so all the waste has to drop to the bottom of the tank. No longer do you have those cubed rectangular tanks that the waste can get stuck in the corners and, and then you have to pay someone to clean out your tanks and all that stuff. That wedge, it has to go to the bottom and then that wedge tank is actually tilted up and angled down to this knife valve. So again, it's we're working with gravity to give you the best experience we can. So all of that waste, all of that fluid has to come to this bottom point and out your knife valve, which is really nice. Put these back real quick. Next bay up, you're going to see the Aqua Hot 600D on the Eagle. This is going to provide you with whole house heat, and it's going to be a, a moist heat, which isn't going to dry you out if you have, I have allergies really bad. If you have allergies, you don't want that dry heat. You wake up in the morning and you're really thirsty or your, your nose is dried out. We're going to give you, it's a nice uh, moist heat um, that is really good for you. But then that is also going to supply you with hot water throughout your coach and your showers and your sinks. So again, that's really, really nice. Just a little storage bay here, but you can see we have the Dirt Devil Central Vac mounted in here. Um, so you're inside and you're cleaning up 
and then you just can come out here when you're dumping your tanks or whatever is real convenient right here pop that out take your uh, bag out also at the back is your fluid for your aqua hot okay right above that is the other side to our dual fuel fills so again you can fill up from either side of the coach this is the other side to that uh, under coach storage again you can see we line all of our luggage bays with the citadel lining that's a really nice uh lining that they use in car washes so it's uh really resistant to water it's gonna be easy to clean out if you need to if you spill something in here and again on a power power button here these trays will can go either way something i want to point out real quick before i want to open up this door to get some light in there if uh shauna can point the camera in here you're gonna see part of this structure of our liberty bridge these these uh black structures and you see we our engineers have uh angle braces and everything to make this foundation really really strong so Next time you're at a show or at a dealer, open up the luggage bays and see all of this. Uh, you can see some of this structure that, that we put into your Liberty Bridge. Before I forget, I just noticed here is going to be in the middle of this bay is your Magnum inverter. So that is your inverter for the coach. Last bay on the driver's side is uh, your fuse bay. It's a little bit of storage here. I've seen guys keep uh, some cleaning supplies here or some tools, but then again, these are gonna be a lot of the fuses for your cockpit are gonna be found here. Um, the computer for the Freightliner dash is found in here. And right here is you've got two air valves. One is to put air into the system. The other on the bottom is general purpose air. So you've got air in this coach we're allowing you to use that air to fill up a bike tire or a, a tire that might be low or or whatever you need might may or may not need air for you can plug an airline here and go bl blow out your air bays your luggage bays if you need to so we provide that for you the top one if you need to put air into the system for some reason you can use the top one to, to service that right above that is our generator slide this uh, American Coach Eagle has a power generator slide on the front. So I didn't open this up all the way, but you can see that you have full access in here to your 12.5 Cummins Onan quiet diesel generator. Um, really, really nice pop that out you don't have to fight the weight of that generator to get that out there and service you don't have to crawl underneath it to service this Just slide this power slide out service it as you need again it has an hour meter here i can show you that right here on the side of your generator you're gonna have an hour meter you also got a start stop a main breaker here again nice big open spot to access your generator We'll close this up and we'll head inside. Let's go take a look inside this 45K. Here we are inside the American Eagle 45K for 2022. And as you can see, I've got it all closed up and there is plenty of room to make it from the front of the coach all the way to the back of the coach. Get to your microwave, your cooktop if you need it to. You have side access to your kitchen sink if you want it. I do have access into the half bath in the middle of the coach. And I have access to our refrigerator. So if you need to pull a drink out or something uh, for uh, your wife when she's driving, your husband, uh, while he's navigating or however you guys work that you have plenty of access throughout the coach when it's all buttoned up in travel mode now let's open it up and show this beautiful coach to you when it's all open all right as you can see i am in the center of the coach i'm standing in front of our firefly control panel 
and I can operate all of our slides from this one location. I just want to point that out because some people don't, don't realize you can actually operate your coach from this Firefly control system. All right, as you can see, I just took out all three slides from the center of the coach. And one thing I wanna point out is this full wall slide on your driver's side or the road side is that HWH slide that we talked about outside. That HWH slide is all hydraulic. That slide actually goes straight out and then down. And that allows us to, can, gives us this big beefy slide and that allows us to put this tile on the slide floor. floor. So, it really makes the coach feel open. That's a really nice, convenient feature of that HWH system. So let's get started at the inside features of this coach. All right, we are up here in the cockpit and this cockpit is really, really nice and convenient. We've re redesigned this in the past couple of years. Um, really nice automotive feel. Um, if I bump this on here without starting the coach, of course, so there is a safety feature be built in. If you start your coach and your shades are down at the front, they are automatically going to retract for safety. Um, so that's something to keep in mind. Again, if your coach is running and you're trying to put those shades down or that blind down, it's not going to go down because your coach is running for safety reasons. But you can see this really nice digital uh, display here for our dash really bright nice bright colors uh, we get that from freightliner custom chassis um, to the left on the left side of the steering wheel is a little knob and i'll i'll get some footage of that to show you you would switch to column or pedals so what that is going to allow you to do is to adjust the steering column on column it's all power adjustable so you can see i can adjust that to whatever is comfortable for me if you flip that to pedals our our accelerator and our brake pedals are power adjustable so again i have shorter legs i might want those those pedals a little bit closer to me if i'm a tall guy i can tuck those pedals back in there and give me a little bit more room so that's a really nice convenient high-end touch feature that we like to give you in american coach um Part of what I explained outside was our select drive and select drive is a nice convenient, it's a convenient feature, but it's also for safety. Um, so you can, if you go into your settings in your, on your dash here, and you would go down to scroll down till you see vehicle configuration and under vehicle configuration, you're going to see steering effort steering effort that is our select drive that is going to allow you to select the effort that you need to put into the wheel so if you are comfortable putting in more effort or you want to put in less effort into this steer to steering you can adjust that right there in your steering in your OptiView dash so what that select drive adjusts is how much effort I've got to start the coach up here how much effort you need to put into this steering wheel, okay? As you can see, I'm turning it with just two fingers. And then it's also a nice, easy back to zero, okay? Really nice, convenient feature. As I mentioned outside, that computer is going to learn how much you're fighting this wheel. You're going to fight that wheel in the wind or roads have a natural curve so that, that uh, debris and water run off of the road and don't pull up on the road where your coach is going to one tend to want to go to the outside of the road because of that curve select drive is going to kind of learn how much you're you're fighting that to keep your coach on the road and eventually as i mentioned you're going to be driving down the road with two fingers really really nice convenient you're not going to get so tired you're going to be more relaxed when you get to your destination really nice convenient feature on select drive some other features up front here, you've got your HWH slide or your HWH leveling system over here to your left so you can level your coach with HWH jacks. We've also got our air levels. So if I go home here, I can actually level the coach 
with the airbags. And this system here is going to allow us to level the coach out with just minor adjustments with the airbags. It's really nice. So you've got jack levels and air level. Really nice automotive style cockpit. It's 2021. Everybody's got a smart device that's probably wireless charging. We've given you some wireless charge spots in your cockpit for you to lay your smartphone and charge it while you're driving around the road. There's one right here for the passenger and there's one over to the left of the driver under the uh, air brake there. So again, you set your, your phone here. It'll charge while you're driving down the road. Really, really nice feature. Last thing I want to point out up here in the cockpit is all new for 2022 and we're really excited to bring this to you is our passenger monitor, okay? This will be on all Eagles um, for 2022. So what that allows you to do is for the, as the passenger, you can loosen this up, put this in a convenient spot for you, okay? I turn this on, this monitor is going to mirror the monitor of the driver. So the, the coach isn't an on, so it's not coming on. But that's going to mirror that monitor, that navigation, the radio, whatever you need. So the driver doesn't have to take their eyes off the road, right? The passenger can find the destination, a restaurant or, or a, a national park or wherever you decide to change your route along the way. No longer does the driver have to take their eyes off the road and adjust the navigation. The passenger can do it all from here. The passenger can say, change the radio station. The passenger can view the cameras. It's a really, really nice, convenient safety feature that we're giving you in the American Eagle. Okay, let's move on back to the living area. We are standing inside a 45K. This is the American Black Walnut cabinetry. I love this cabinetry. It, it's the natural woods coloring grain of American black walnut. I mean, I love the variation in grain from door to door, the different tones of, of that brown and orange. I think it looks really, really rich. We've paired that with Cambria quartz countertops. This decor, I'm gonna have to look at the name. This decor, is Bermuda Cove, okay? So we've paired this American Black Walnut with this Bermuda Cove decor, and the highlight of Bermuda Cove is this Cambria Quartz countertop. Look at this very bold, rich graining in this countertop, this quartz countertop. I think it is absolutely gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. So uh, really, I think it's gonna be an eye popper at shows, at dealer lots, so hopefully you get a chance to see this in person. Another really nice uh, benefit of this decor is this furniture fabric. Um, it is really, really soft. You can't feel it on camera, but you can see it has this really rich feel to it. Um, almost looks like a hide, but it's really, really soft. It's really, really durable. It looks phenomenal in this Bermuda Cove decor. Okay. Enough about the decor. You need to see this in person, but let's talk about the furniture pieces. Over here behind the passenger is a pull-out queen bed. Nice big sofa. Behind the sofa is a pop-up TV. The, con the control for that TV is going to be over here on the side, over across from the TV. You can pop that TV up when you need it. A game, a movie, whatever you've got going on. My favorite part about that TV is you put it down when you don't need it and you have that really nice big window out your patio side hopefully you're staring at a lake or a mountainscape something somewhere let all that natural light in you've got another big window across from that one behind your theater seats to let all that natural light in i'm going to our another firefly control panel in a convenient spot. We don't want you to have to always go back to that center spot. So we've given you select controls here by your seating. Reach up and you can put up all of your roadside shades. Okay. 
Another, some other controls in here, you've got lighting. You can kill all your lights at once if you want, turn them all on at the same time or select spots. We've also pre-programmed in what we call moods. So if you're getting ready to watch a movie or you're just reading a book and you don't want a lot of light inside in the evening, you just hit front mood and it's gonna go to that preset lighting configuration. So as you can see, the living area lights have been dimmed, but we've left your accent lights on in this mood. If we hit mood two, now it's only the accent lights and all of the other lights are, are turned off. So uh, really, really nice convenient features um, in American Coach. Theater, motion power lounge. Um, this is really, really comfortable. As I mentioned with the fabric, you got controls here to pop this out, get comfortable, pop the TV up across the way. It does have adjustable headrest, power headrest. So as you can see, I'm moving that. So whatever is comfortable for you, you can adjust that. So you're not getting that crick in your neck or getting a sore neck from reading a book or whatever. Your cup holder does light up. Some people don't notice. There is a little USB port in your cup holder. So if you do have to charge your tablet or your smart device, your phone, whatever, as you're sitting here, you do have capabilities to charge that. In the center of this motion power lounge theater seat, lots of deep storage, um, books, magazines, blankets, pillows, whatever, whatever, plenty of room for all of that. There's also storage on both ends of this seating and we're giving you a matching little table. And a lot of people ask me at shows, what is this button for? That's not a button. That's where this table would pop into for drinks, tablet, laptop, crossword puzzle, whatever you're doing in the evenings, in the daytime, watching TV with a cold one. That's what that's for. You don't need it. Pop it out, tuck it out of the way. Just behind the theater seating is our freestanding dinette. Um, I think this highlights this Cambria Quartz really well with this nice, dark, uh, aggressive graining in that quartz. I love it. Um, little lock on the bottom there if you unlock that this will slide out you grab the two seats from the back of the coach or wherever you store them now you have seating for four okay really nice comfortable stylish dinette with some storage um, that you can do as fit your needs on both sides here And there is storage underneath up top here storage we've got some bags from the furniture in there uh, you can see nice soft closing doors on our cabinetry in american coach we're going to bump over to the galley um, you notice when i ran this out that this peninsula does not move a lot of people think that this goes in and out the slide actually comes out over the top of this portion but that extends your workspace, gives you more countertop space, more workspace for preparing meals or, or entertaining. Um, these nice black hardwood, hardwood black walnut cabinetry looks really nice. You notice inside in American Coach, we are using the light um, Ozite fabric. Um, a lot of the manufacturers will use a darker Ozite lining it just kind of makes the cabinetries feel dark and, and cave-like. This all, it gives you the safety and convenience of a line cabinetry, but it's light. It keeps, keeps that light feeling in American Coach. These are adjustable shelves. You can adjust these to whatever fits your need. Samsung black stainless steel appliances throughout. They all match. This black stainless steel looks really, really good with this black walnut. Um, induction cooktop. Uh, there are some uh, covers for this that we've got stored away somewhere. Um, again, there, there's the covers for the induction cooktop we've got in there. Um, again, soft close doors everywhere. We've got storage underneath. There you're going to see your subwoofer for your sound system. This is a drawer. Some people think it's not a drawer. 
that is a drawer and i'll point out this really nice finished drawer shell is not uh it's not that plywood rough look that you'll see in a lot of coaches it's a really nice finished look again soft closing drawers something right here is a dishwasher okay that the fisher pakel dishwasher really nice convenient your uh, Blanco Sil Granite sink. This is a very nice high end um, sink. It's not going to get damaged. Uh, it holds up really, really well to drop in your dishes in here if you have an ac accidentally drop those in. Um, scrubbing on it to clean it, it's not going to hurt it. Really nice high end look. I like this clean, again, this, this darker sink with this quartz countertop. Paired with the black walnut, I think our designers did a really, really good job of pairing these colors and these tones and these textures together. Uh, really nice. This the sink has a little shelf in here. Um, if Shauna wants to point that out real quick, this shelf it's raised up a little bit, so maybe you only need this much water and your rinse and vegetables or something. You can drop them in this and keep water down here. It's a really nice, really nice sink um, for those that chef sink that we've given you. Really nice backsplash. Let's move on back here. This is your Firefly control panel for your Eagle. This is the, the center of your coach. But I just noticed something I almost forgot to talk about that you guys called me out on on the last video. So I wanna make sure I talk about this phenomenal refrigerator right here. This is a, again, a Samsung black stainless steel residential refrigerator. These uh, little refrigerator locks here are really nice, convenient. There are magnets in them, so you can't, well, you can, but hopefully you won't lose them because they're always going to be right there. Really nice, big residential refrigerator. Um, lots of storage. Freezer down below. Right, residential. This middle drawer is actually kind of a hybrid drawer. This can be a refrigerator drawer for drinks or, or snacks or whatever. It can also be freezer. So however you need that to set that up for your needs, you can do. And this is Samsung's Smart Hub. This is only available in the Eagle. Um, really nice, kind of a need to have, not or want to have, not need to have kind of thing. There's a camera built into this refrigerator, okay? So when your coach is at the campground or at home or at the resort and you're on Wi-Fi, you're connected to the network through Wi-Fi, the campground's internet or your data plan or whatever, you can dial, you can pull out the app on your smartphone while you're at the grocery store because you didn't remember if you were out of milk and you can look inside your refrigerator from the grocery store to see if you're out of milk. I love it. I don't know if we have to have it, but it's really cool to have. So again, high end features in American Coach. Okay, back to the Firefly panel. Again, this is your center hub of your coach. You can control most of the coach from this from this spot. On the home screen, you're gonna get kind of a breakdown of your coach, interior and exterior lights, and you can preset a couple of uh, presets there for your lights, um, your blinds and your shades. Uh, you're gonna see your uh, power source. Right now I'm running off the generator and I can see the volts I'm pulling off the generator. Um, uh, yeah, I can start my generator or kill my generator from here. I can see the levels on my tanks, fresh gray and black tanks. Um, I can start my electric heat or my diesel heat in the aqua hot, um, which I accidentally just did. Let me turn that off. I can start my water pump. That's all on the home screen. The, the, information you're going to want right away you see that on your home screen let's bump over to the lights control you can control all the lights in your coach from here your shades and your blinds you can control from that that uh setting the therm the little thermo thermometer thermostat you're going to be able to control all of your your temperature in your coach all three zones you got three air conditioners on this coach so you can control uh all three zones from this one spot you can turn your floor heat on. This coach has floor heat throughout. Really nice. Now, something I like to point out on our floor heat is that floor heat is an electric mat underneath the tile. We don't like to use the uh, uh, the aqua hot type system to heat our floors. 
because that's not a real even heat in flooring. It takes time for that water to make it through the whole floor, through that piping system under the floor. The electric mat is a nice, even heat really quick. So it's gonna warm your coach up with your floor heat on a crisp morning or a chilly evening. You won't even have to turn your furnace on. You're gonna be able to warm your coach up with the floor heat just in, in a matter of minutes and it's gonna be an even heat. So it's a, it's a nice benefit to that electric mat floor heating. Again, as I pointed out earlier, you can control all of your slides. So this panel, it looks like a little motorhome, this button does. You're gonna see you can control all of your slides and also all of your awnings from this panel right here. So I can control my front and rear awnings and my window and door awnings all from this panel here. Um, and I can also stop those wherever I need to. So if there's a tree a little bit closer than I like it, I can't extend my awnings all the way extend it until you need to stop it and just hit stop it's really nice audio video controls right here um, utilities your engine block heater uh, your fans you can even even has a little uh, feature here it looks like a hand with a rag you can wipe the monitor off from all the fingerprints and it's going to freeze this screen for 15 seconds or 30 seconds, whatever you need to clean that screen. It's gonna do a countdown for you. Um, so you're not changing any of the settings in your coach while you clean your monitor. So again, that Firefly system is really, really nice. That does have an app that you can put on your smartphone that you can control most of these features from your smartphone. You just have to download the app. You connect the app to your coach through through this panel here, um, it'll it'll help you set this up. Uh, pairing right here, if you go to pairing, you can scan that QR code. It's gonna tell you everything you need to do to connect this smartphone to this system. And then you can control most of these controls from your smartphone, smart device. It's really nice. All right, back, half bath in the middle of the coach is really, really nice. Again, we've got the Cambria Quartz countertops in here throughout, uh, same backsplash style. Um, really nice little half bath for your guests. Uh, or I like to say this is his bathroom and that big one at the back is her bathroom. So uh, I know that's how it would be with my wife. Um, but again, really nice. And there is a Firefly monitor in here. Um, know those big bulky switches um, throughout nice queen pantry storage is right to the rear of the refrigerator again really nice soft closing sliding uh, storage here uh, one thing I like to that I like being a shorter guy with short arms this pulls out all the way so I don't have to reach back in there to get what I need it comes out to me and uh, I'm a happy guy Again, plenty of pantry storage for whatever you need there. All right, back into the master suite. One thing that I think a lot of people kind of take for granted or don't even realize are uh, your bedroom closes off with a real, first off, it's, it's a really nice looking door, panel door, right? Um, but it's all solid wood. It looks really, really, this black walnut looks really, really good, so. And that does lock closed or lock open so it's not flying all over the place. You've got a uh, Encore series adjustable bed, king size bed, really comfortable. Um, that does go up and down with the remote. So a lot of people ask, what, how much room do I have when this bed is down? So we'll put this down for you. And you can stop this wherever is comfortable for you. So if you're reading and you want your head raised up a little bit in the morning or in the evening, or you're watching TV and you don't want to lay flat, you can kind of adjust this to wherever you are comfortable. And then when you're ready to go to sleep, you can lay it flat. So as you can see, laid flat, plenty of room to walk around the bed. I really like the uh, designer headboard there. Our designers, again, are, are doing a phenomenal job in these coaches. 
Um, smart devices, we all rely on them. We've given you some more wireless charging stations back here. You just lay your phone here at night and it's gonna charge. You've got outlets on both sides of the bed. And in that outlet is a couple of USB uh, plugs. Um, again, for all of your smart devices, um, you don't need those adapters. Those are on both sides. One thing I like to point out in the e in this coach is if I move these pillows out of the way and I'm gonna take this camera, if you need to turn your lights out at night, we've given you a panel just above your head. So you can operate your coach and your lights and your generator from in the bed, okay? At the foot of the bed, you have all of your wardrobe storage. Nice, ample uh, storage. Again, really nice finished drawers, soft closing drawers and doors. Really nice, wide, deep dresser drawers here. You've got three of those. Um, Try to give you as much storage as we can in this coach. A nice big TV. Uh, we've given you a little bit of storage behind the TV or the, or this would be where you'd have all of your uh, electronic devices, your DVDs or your uh, uh, Amazon Fire TV or your Apple TV or whatever device you use to watch TV or movies. You can just put that back here and plug them into the back of your TV very conveniently. And then you have storage. We've also given you a, a safe to hide your valuables. Last thing I want to point out back here is you probably saw it up under the uh, overhead cabinets above the bed was there's a camera selector switch and I can show that to you once again. So just behind the monitor is a camera selector switch. Now what that camera selector switch allows you to do is if this TV is on the right input and you hit that camera selector switch it's gonna take those outside cameras and make them a security system. So now you can see what's going on outside of your coach on this really big TV. So if you hear something at night or you're not sure where your kids are at or, or whatever, for whatever reason you would need to see outside your coach, you can hit that camera selector switch on the right input for this TV and you're gonna be able to select and, and, and go through each of those cameras one by one or uh, and stop at the one you need. You can also do that up at that TV in the living area. There's a switch underneath the cabinet, camera selector switch that takes those outside cameras and makes them into a security system for your coach. Really nice safety, convenient feature. All right, back last, back here in this master bath, really, really nice big master bath. Again, our designers did a phenomenal job with this Cambria Quartz with the American Black Walnut. Uh, I think it looks really, really good. His and her sinks, um, nice and convenient. Backlit mirrors are really nice. And there's uh, a medicine cabinet behind each one. This little shelf would be really convenient for, for makeup or, or toiletries or whatever you have. Um, really convenient big big shower um i think this this spa like shower looks really really good there's a accent tile in here for shelves uh this nice teak seat um for resting or shaving your legs or whatever um and that tucks up out of the way i love how we've hidden the drain kind of hidden the drain you don't have that big ugly stainless steel drain you've got it's kind of hidden that's a spa like drain um, uh, the shower wand um, again really nice spa like feature this uh, skylight above it's nice for those taller guys guys and gals because because we're able to tuck that shower head up into that skylight to give you more headroom but I love how it lets all that natural light pour in and it really makes the shower really nice and bright. Um, so, 
just behind the shower is going to be your stackable residential Samsung washer and dryer. Again, Samsung appliances throughout. Residential washer and dryer. Uh, really nice feature that we're giving you in American Coach. Just above that, you're gonna see some uh, breakers and stuff for your coach. Rear wardrobe, full length war hanging wardrobe, cedar lined, really nice feature. Porcelain toilet um, in the mid half bath and back here, nice toilet. Um, last feature, and this eagle that I really want to make sure you guys see is this shelving. Um, this is our exclusive uh, emergency exit door. We hope that you never need this emergency exit door, but we want to provide it for you in case you do. This is going to operate a lot like an airplane exit door. You unlock it, pop this handle, and this these steps are actually going to fold down. They're not going to fall off or anything. They're going to fold down. And now these steps, next time you see one, if you feel on the bottom, there's tread on the bottom of this shelf. So it's functional. It looks good when you don't need that. And hopefully you never do. You can store whatever you need here. But you pop this out and these steps, these shelves now become steps where you can egress and escape out of your coach if you ever need to safely. You don't have to jump out of a high exit uh, door or window. Really nice exclusive feature to American Coach. All right, that wraps up the walkthrough on the 2022 American Eagle 45K. Again, the exterior graphic of this coach was Coastal Retreat. The cabinetry in this one is American Black Walnut and the interior decor, I slipped up a little bit, it's Independence. Bermuda Cove, I said earlier, Bermuda Cove is one of the uh, textures in this actual uh, decor. This decor is called Independence. So check it out at your dealer um, or uh, any upcoming show. If you want to check out or build your own American Coach, you can go to AmericanCoach.com and click up in the right corner, there's a build and price tool. So you can build out and customize your American Coach to however you want and you can see that price. So for this coach, the base manufactured suggested price on the American Eagle 45K is $875,000. But always go to your dealer, go to your dealer, get the best price you can get. They can work with you. Um, make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification button because we want you to be notified when we do more of these videos. And if you go to our website, subscribe to our newsletter so you get all kinds of updates from american coach and you're going to get some really cool travel tips we've been doing some really cool drink recipes um some really cool stuff coming from american coach so stay tuned